I'm standing here in downtown New Braunfels, Texas, getting footage of the old Comal County Courthouse. And it is high noon. Got here just in time to capture those beautiful bells. Up on top of that bell tower. This is the historic district 
of New Braunfels, Texas. To my right is the roundabout town square plaza. Panning to the left. These are the official offices of the region. The Comal County Courthouse Annex. Just up the street a little ways, there's the old city hall. Another interesting historic building. And then right across the next street, I just passed by is the county tax assessor's office. And I've got some business to attend to in there. So I'll shoot around the building just a little bit and then we'll go in and see how it goes. Hello. Hi. Here we are back at the tax office. Oh, sorry. Thank Excuse you. Excuse me. Couldn't see you in there. It says here. Attention, all persons and property entering this building are subject to search. Sheriff Comal County, main entrance, no title transfers after 4 p.m. They also want everybody to realize that there are security cameras in use. And we're at the Property Tax and Motor Vehicles Office. So I've just gone back to the car and dropped off the SLR camera and tripod that I was using to get some B-roll footage on the street, take some long shots. And I also took my concealed carry pistol and left it in the car. And although I didn't see anything posted on the door at the tax office that expressly prohibited the carrying of guns on this property, it being a government building run by the sheriff's department, I should probably brush up on all of the laws and rules governing concealed carry into these kinds of places before I make any attempt. I want to make sure to stay well on the clear side of the law here. And here is another sign. This is the third one I've seen that says, Warning, security cameras in use. And here... Behind this door, it's got the state of Texas seal, and it clearly states authorized personnel only. And they have some kind of a keypad here for people to get in. But we're not going to try to go in that way, just into the main office to conduct our business here.
budget roughly it all came back into the So when they so Assume that there by that without that sign, it's public forum. I'm looking at motorcycles on your phone, dude. Registering <laughs> one right now. Cool. <laughs> An old one. Nice. Is that it? <laughs> no, it's just a. This is a motor sale, actually. But, no, mine's not ready for all that Photoshop yet. My boyfriend's trying to get one, and I'm like, no. Ah, the no. Yeah. No. Nonsense. No. Yeah. Because when I was like, I was little, little, and I was like, with my grandparents in San Antonio. And we were turning into a cemetery. My grandparents live at like on 1604 in Abidoches over there. Mm -hmm. And we were turning into the uh, the Holy Cross Cemetery. And, and uh, we were turning, we we're trying to turn in. But at that time, there was no turning lane, right? Yeah. And a, a motorcycle came in, hauling butt, hit us, and the dude flew up in the air. Oh my goodness. So that's why I don't want him to have a motorcycle. <laughs> Well, they're pretty dangerous, yes. and the uh, the chance of getting pretty badly hurt when you wreck one is pretty mm -hmm. high. That's why I want them to have one. I've wrecked a few. I'm still here. Yeah, yeah some people do. And okay. then my stepdad had one. I don't know what he had. And then it rained, it rained on us. We were driving on the river road, mm -hmm. and so we started sliding, and I was like, mm -mm, get me off this. Take me home. And right up, I think that next, that next week, he sold it. Well, do me a favor. If you're ever going down hard, just think. Those people in the tax association. Oh, don't worry. Stop Everybody me. you tell you have like, wants to tell you a story about something that's not normal. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's nature of the business. I, like I know. Them. I like them. I love them. And if the juice is worth the squeeze, God bless you. Just keep playing life insurance. It's fine. You said what? Just keep playing life insurance. My old lady will find a new life I can't hear over you. I can't. No. You're doing unnecessary stuff. You're doing unnecessary stuff. So when you just got a vintage? Oh, it's a 79. So it, well, that is vintage these days, yeah. What, uh, what make is it? It's a Harley. Oh, cool. That's pretty great. Yeah, that's my kind of late 60s and into the early 80s that what? style of motor riding. But I've got a few Stop inches. This is just one I came up with. My buddy might have it. Well, I'm a drummer and I just bought a 70s vintage Ludwig snare drum. So, mm -hmm. same Something thing. about the nostalgia of the older. Oh, yeah. You just see the, the logos and the things that you were used to seeing when you were a kid. 
Wouldn't it? Yes, we're just a little bit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Hey, I need my driver's license. Oh, no, you can't. Can you stop yelling at me, please? She'll get used to it. He's only eight, he's only eight months old, too. <laughs> this is my first. The yelling hasn't even started yet. Oh, he's not even teething. Yet. He doesn't even have teeth, and he's eight Jeff months. Like, we know somebody that just turned seven months, and he has two teeth. Don't get hung up on all those milestones. It's a waste of your energy, I promise you. Don't be in a hurry. They're not talking fast enough. They're talking fast enough. Forget all that. He'll do it. When he he's said hi yesterday. He was trying to say hi to my mom, and he said it. I do it. It was kind of weird. Yeah, he didn't say hi to my mom. 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 Yeah, he didn't say hi to there will be a, come a time when you wish you didn't learn to talk yet. Yeah. You didn't know how to walk yet. Because they don't go, they don't walk long. They go straight to running. I don't think he wants to crawl. Hmm. I don't think he'll he skip. Does. He might skip it. My, my oldest went from rolling to running. My niece, my sister's youngest, she went from, she didn't even crawl. She scooted mm -hmm. everywhere. That's, all she, that's how she got. I know a kid like that once. They never crawled. They just kind of crab walked everywhere. He doesn't even want to crawl. He wants to walk. 37? Oh, let's see if I can carry him now. Okay. You hear? Okay. Cool. I might need to carry him like this. I can't do the I'm sure the registration. I don't want to yeah, well, yeah, this is a motorized gimbal. I'm just getting used to it, trying to kind of take it everywhere and get used to it. I went and did it yesterday in the post office and it freaked out. They came charging. Oh, I know. I had my old, of my. I like watching the First Amendment offers. You're, you're sitting next to one, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you like? Um, the one that seems to irritate him the most is outside the police station. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's been filming the police cars. And all. Yeah, exactly. It's amazing how many public officials don't even know their own policies. Or they don't call. They just don't well, make it go away. I had my 80 year old disabled dad waiting in the hot car, and I was just going to mail a package for him, and I thought, I'll just roll it while I send this package off. I had to go, but otherwise I probably would have been there until the cops got there. Mm -hmm. yeah, I've got poster seven right here. Yeah, and here's the close up of poster seven. And here's the 2018 DHS memo. So it says it's the public's right to photograph publicly accessible federal facility buildings. But they just don't know that, man. So. I don't know why they care. Well, what was wild about it in the post office is there's this contagion. Like, one lady started freaking out. And then everybody started getting on that same vibration. And by the time I got to the clerk, he was like, don't film me. I said, I just want to send this package. He said, I'm not going to send it to you during the camera. Um, yeah, right? I don't think that's true, but okay. Yeah. Getting into some uh, denial of my constitutional rights area that under the color of law. So I told him, look, I gotta go, but I completely have the right to be here and the right to film, and I'll be back. Yeah, right, when I've got time, just wait. I'll yeah. see you again. I gotta charge up my batteries, <laughs> have a healthy breakfast, and I'll be back. Oh, I'm 39, sorry. Sorry. Hello. Hi. I hope you can help me with this. I am trying to get a temporary disabled placard oh, yes, sir. For, for my uh, elderly father. And I have his ID right here, and there's a prescription.
Okay, are we using the driver's license or the passport? He, he was traveling and he got his wallet stolen, so he currently doesn't have a driver's license, but I brought his passport, which he just we'll got. We'll change the number then. Okay, thank you. Oh, thanks very much. I need that opened up one more time, and then we'll change out this number. So we're using the passport. Oh, you want me to do it? Yes, sir. Okay. I can't fill out anything. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's see. Oh, there it is at the top. Okay. I'm going to put a line through that. And just initial. Hello. Hi. Hello. Um, can I write it here? Right here is fine, sir. I can't write that small. Is this space okay? Then try writing it here, sir. Okay. Okay. Let me see if that's one of the options. Let me see if that's one of the options here. So I see that it's reading for driver's license or ID number. Hmm. So let me double check if I can use that. Okay, thank you. Let me try and I'll be right back. Thanks very much. You're still here? Uh, that 2014 hasn't been inspected. Let me guess. You're chewing on stuff? The 2014 kicking your feet? has not been inspected. Like that kind of stuff? Yeah, that's all I'm doing. Hello? 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 I don't have the passport. I have the driver's license, an ID, and I have four military. Okay. So he'll have to go to the DPS and get a, an ID we can card? We use the, um, the paper license, the ID card, he, and the driver's license. He hasn't driven in a few years, so I, I'll have to let him know, and we'll, we'll see what option he wants to do from there. Okay. okay thanks if very not, much. If not, we can apply for an ID. Okay, and that's also through the DPS? Yes, sir. Okay. And we can definitely accept the ID card. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Bye -bye. Have a great day, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Well, I'd say that's definitely a clear green light there for the tax assessor collector office. Everybody in the lobby was very friendly unthreatened. The lady at the counter acted as if the camera wasn't even there and just gave me outstanding and friendly customer service. The Comal County Tax Assessor's Office gets a green light.